Hi again everyone, it's Peter and this time I have Alison Nell with me and Alison, I believe you're the marketing person who looks after all the people who are interested in properties with Prime Property. So tell me what your role is first. My role within Prime Property is to deal with the, um, the marketing and the sales which means I, I see myself as a frontline troop. I have the best job in the whole company because I get to deal with the clients and I match clients with products, which is, as I said, the best job in the company. We talked a little bit with Sid about the projects you're doing. The apartments that we talked about, can you describe those apartments? Are, are we talking about five star, six star, four star? and? We've talked about some of the locations. Maybe there's some that suit different locations. And what are some of the features? Yes, in our company we uh, sell premium quality apartments uh, located within an apartment hotel um, complex normally, mixed-use developments. Um, we have them in corporate stay towns and corporate stay areas such as Toowoomba, Perth, and my favourite one would have to be Gladstone. We've actually got a few in, a few in the pipeline and one already existing in Gladstone. I like what I sell because it's quite different from everything else in the market. We have apartments built to a certain quality and finish, uh, the extra high ceilings, um, the development always, always has all the lifts, has all the features you would expect, the marble bench tops, high quality products for um, Top end, top end of the town, um, corporate stay in each of our locations. Gladstone at the moment, I've just sold that very quickly. Our second development, as, which is an off the plan development, sold almost as quickly as our first development, which opened two years ago there. And it's really um, the premium accommodation experience in Gladstone. And that's what, why I like to sell what I sell and why it sells so quickly. People expect quality in the invest, property investment market because they want their product to last 20 years and look, still look brand new. So, so there's, no, there's nobody disappointed? Probably one of my most favourite days in each year is if we have an opening ceremony at one of our developments because a lot of my clients come from interstate and overseas and I love it when they make the journey and they actually say that it's better than it is in the brochures. Um, it's very hard to show quality in a brochure. So when they come, I enjoy meeting them for example, how do you explain a sweeping ocean view in Gladstone to someone over the world's most um, successful harbour, the biggest coal port in, in the world? So when you build a development with sweeping views right through and you see the ocean and the ships coming in from the horizon from the balcony, it's something you can't explain in a brochure. So I don't, I've never met a disappointed client at an opening ceremony ever. It's a, one of my most favourite events each time. Yeah. Okay, well look... I know that Sid uh, spent a lot of time talking about the returns. Um, can you give us a bit of our, you're selling the product, so what sort of price range are we looking at for apartments, like one bedders, two bedders, or do you build three bedders? Can you give us a bit of a, a rundown of the price range? Well, in each of our developments, we sell, um, our prices built, our prices created around bank valuation prices. There's no cream in our prices, which surprises people for the high quality of our developments. For example, we will do one bedrooms in Gladstone, two and three bedrooms. Um, a two bedroom in, in Gladstone, two. The cheapest one I sold, or the range of prices, was high 300s to mid 400s, uh, which is well within, we keep it within the investor price range, not um, it could be put in easily put in prestige luxury price range, but I we we desire to attract as many property investors as we can, and to do that, all the capital growth has to belong to the investor. So we sell it at or below um, bank valuation price, and for that we have we have happy clients that have stuck with us for over many of them have stuck with us for well over a decade, some 15 years, and I like meeting new ones knowing that they uh, they like to get all the capital growth themselves in every development, not the developer. So, um, so yes, one bedrooms in Gladstone 2, as we call it, Gladstone Central Plaza, started at 270000 and went up to about two ninety nine. dollars um, And then other ones, the two bedrooms, went from high 300s through to about four fifty, four fifty five. dollars um, That was in the early off the plan. Of course, 
that can change um, each development, the, the building price gets higher, but we stay at the correct bank valuation price for it. And that, that is what investors love, getting, getting in at the right price point. Really appreciate you sharing that part of it because often investors think, oh, who's making the money in this deal? And so uh, to hear you say that is really good for the investor. And so uh, if that is a consistent thing that comes through in all your developments, that is very positive for the investor. So investors, take note. Now, the last question I'd like to ask you, and, and I know you've been with Sid a long time. Yes. Now, what drives that man and what, what, what is it that uh, he has brought to your organisation to make it so unique? I've asked him this question, but I'd like to hear it from you because you know him up close. As you know, um, Sid is, is the captain of the ship in uh, yeah, Prime yeah. Property and um, what's driven him from the very beginning is and it even surprises me um, over the years because it's a consistent theme is his absolute respect and enjoyment of his clients and seeing his clients make money out of property. Um, he creates his own product uh, to make sure that they get the best value for money as they go in. He creates a system where they can maximise their returns and he's there um, years and years later for follow-up for them and for advice. Being around 20-something years is very much appreciated by your clients. Standing behind the product you sell, um, but he has a very deep, passionate belief in seeing other people make money out of property, even more so than seeing himself make money out of it. He loves property. <laughs> well, look, I think that sums it up, everybody, who's been... Uh, look, you've heard from Sid, now you've heard from his wife, and um, she's endorsed exactly what I was saying that you have a really unique company here that you're dealing with and very unique people, particularly knowing what I've learned uh, over the years myself and I've, I've been able to get a bit of that out of yourself, <laughs> Alison and Sid today. This is what we want you to look into. So please uh, contact Alison, contact someone from the office or at least register your interest in their projects. And thank you again, Alison. Pleasure was mine. It's okay. <laughs>